Welcome to my project Bazaar.com Let's see the title of our project Our project title is Protocol Description with Animation Using Android Let's see the abstract of our project In early process we want to know that the function of the protocols We really need the computers and the other powerpoint software So the process to of to know the protocol function are very difficult to everyone Another one drawback is each protocol function should be downloaded from internet or books. So to eliminate this process to know the protocol function process we are using an android. In android we are developing an application that contains a protocol function process. In this application we don't need any other software or internet facilities are not needed. We don't need a computer to know the protocol function process. In this application, we simply install this application to each user mobile phones. This application that contains the many protocols and their function description with animation view. In existing system, we need the computers to view the protocol function process. Also, we need the PowerPoint or document narrator software that is needed to know their specific protocol functions. Another one drawback is we cannot carry this protocol definition to anywhere. In the existing system, the unwanted information are attached to the process protocol definitions are available. In our proposed system, we are using a Android platform to eliminate the many factors. In our system, we develop a protocol function process that only require a mobile phone to run their application. We don't need by any other software. We don't need computers to view the protocol function process. Also, Android that provides the animation view of the each protocols. We can easily carry these mobile phones to anywhere. Let's see the data flow of this project. First, the initial step is the user install this application to their mobile phone. After installing the project that contains a home page, the home page will contain a different protocols. So, user select any one protocol. After that. The animation view of the protocols will be displayed. This is Android platform is required to run this application. So the home page of this application that contains many protocols like SMTP, FTP, UCP of our project. Let's see the demo of our project. The proto is our application icon. So click this icon. After clicking, the home page of this project will be displayed. So in the home page of this application that can contains the different protocols like TCP/IP, UDP, ICMP, IGMP, FTP, DHCP, ARP, RARP, HTTP, SMTP. So for example, if the user want to know the animation view of the ARP protocol, that means the user click the ARP button. So after clicking the ARP, the one page will be opened. So click the forward button. So this process first on computer that sends a ARP request to the on computer. So I click next forward. Also same computer then sends a ARP request to the another one host. So the same computer that sends a ARP request to three host. After the sending the ARP. The center system will be replay the ARP request. So this is the re replay from the ARP request. So this is the router. This is the IP address. So for example, other other one is HTTP. So this is the internet client. So next one is server. So after one is firewall. Our server B. So internet. So the HTTP protocol that is used to access the other computer information through the firewall. The TC the UDP IP protocol means user data gram protocol. This protocol that is used to to transfer the data 
वायर वायरलेस कनेक्शन सो दिस इज आई जी एम पी प्रोटोकॉल दिस मीन्स इंटरनेट ग्रुप मेसेज प्रोटोकॉल दिस प्रोटोकॉल दैट इज यूज टू ग्रुप द मेसेज इन ए ऑनलाइन सो आई सी एम पी इंटरनेट कंट्रोल मेसेज प्रोटोकॉल दिस प्रोटोकॉल इज यूज टू कंट्रोल द मेसेज एफ टी पी दिस मीन्स फाइल ट्रांसफर प्रोटोकॉल दिस इज यूज टू ट्रांसफर द मोबाइल बिटवीन द होस्ट ए एंड होस्ट बी या इंटरनेट so for example this is a sender this is a recipient uh, how to data transfer using ftp protocol so first click a forward button so first the server sender first upload the file to the net server online server after that the ftp server that is used to store these data so this protocol ftp protocol that is used to transfer this protocol to the recipient so finally let's make great check it now so escape so another one example is icmp icmp means internet control message protocol provided within the ip which generate error message to help ip layers icmp is provided within the ip which generates error message to help ip layers so if you in a source this is destination icmp you go request if you want to know the other details please click enter so after entering this this project that contains a protocol definition this is the manual drawing about the icmp protocol so first one is source then the second means icmp ego request so router icmp ego request to next one is router to finally icmp ego request one finally the destination after that the router one reply the source so tcp ip protocol means transmission control protocol this protocol that is used to transfer the data between host a to host b this is a wired connection and secure connection this is a layer that is used to for file transfer in tcp ip there are seven layers are used in tcp ip if you want to know the tcp ip how it work click the enter after that click forward so first one is the server file transfer server click forward so the computer server that is connect to the telecom internet after that the each server that is connected to internet internet so click forward click forward so many computer that show this online cloud storage after that this one is stored with the uh, file transfer server so user data gram protocol this protocol that is used to data transfer between two clients without using a wired connections for example this is a udp data transfer so are you getting so i don't care but send it what that means the udp only send the data but not acknowledgement for the sending data this is the concept of the udp yes it is not used in user data gram protocol this is the overall cost for the so another one is smtp simple mail transfer protocol so first one is smt client other one is smt server so click next so incoming connection send the mail if the smt client send the mail to the smt server first one send the mail after that the smt server get this mail after that the source and the external are scanned by direction incoming filters in the server after that smr smtb client message sent to the smtp server dhcp dynamic host configuration protocol this protocol is used for the method to automatically assign ip address along with other parameters for example client so send the icmp echo request to the server the server automatically replies the dhcp request to client after that the client send the another one request to the server finally the server send the icmp request to the client thank you